Welcome back to The Price of Business. I'm your host, Kevin Price, talking to you about you and your business. Going to spend some time with Sean Miller. By the way, uh, you can learn more about him at SeanMMiller.com. Plus, he's got an article he participated in an interview for us over at uh, PriceofBusiness.com, a series of articles that we've been doing on when you have to pitch to the CEO. Sean gave us some insight on how to do just that. Sean's been seen on a lot of different media. We're delighted to have him here today on The Price of Business. Welcome to the show. Hey, Kevin, how are you, sir? Good, thank you. And yourself? Oh, doing great, man. We're having a lot of fun. Thanks for the uh, Ted Nugent intro up there. In Michigan, you know, it's home of the Nuge. Yeah, what part of Michigan? (laughs) I'm over in Holland, just up the uh, beautiful Lake Michigan coast from Chicago. Yep. Uh, Holland, Michigan? Yes, sir. Yeah, I've been there many times uh, for the Uh, Tulip Tulip Festival. I grew up in in Ferndale. Oh, right on, right on, right, right on. Right on, yeah, the uh, other side uh, there on the uh, well, on the east side. But anyway, awesome, glad to have you on. Let's talk a little yeah. bit about what you do. Yeah, well, I, you know, I'm an entrepreneurial guy, Kevin. I do a lot of things. We've got a, three companies and various projects and investments, and we're just, like I say, we're just up the coast from Chicago, so we get into all kinds of trouble in business in Chicago and have a lot of fun and work with a lot of uh, really family-owned businesses and really dynamic individuals. Uh, we're we're launching, uh, you know, the CEO thing. We're launching a program right now. Uh, this is new this year, which is called the Celebrity CEO Model. And what we're doing with that, Kevin, is we're working. The reason we're connecting with uh, the CEOs is we're we're finding guys that are really dynamic, self-made entrepreneurs that have built a company of at least a hundred million dollars in size that have the persona to become. Well, we've called the, the next generation of Shark Tank billionaires, the celebrity entrepreneurs. So we have to connect with them now. Okay, very interesting. Tell us a little bit about uh, why, why you're connecting, what the objectives are, what the long-term goals are. Give us some of that. Sure. Well, we've, we're working, we've been working in the authority creation space for some time. And we've added in our business coaching process now that really the intentional creation of celebrity. And when what we've got, when we put that positioning of authority together with the posturing of celebrity, and from what I've seen about you, you get this, you understand this well. But when you put that position, that authority and celebrity together, you can create in business today a really unique space of that celebrity entrepreneur. And we talk about a, the magic allure of the celebrity entrepreneur. I've got a great quote from the other day. Uh, Mark Cuban said, uh, I, there's nobody that won't take my call. And that's, that's really not him being cocky. That's just reality. And that's the, the, right, that's the access opportunity that one has when they can achieve that really special new niche that, an Oprah Winfrey or a Donald Trump or a Mark Cuban or a Richard Branson enjoy today. So are you trying to actually cultivate that? Or are you trying to cultivate yeah. individuals who have that kind of status? We're, we're trying it. We're, well, we're not trying. We're doing it. We're developing that intentionally. <laughs> those, those are fighting words. People. Hey, I didn't mean to offend yeah. you, man. <laughs> well, you know, we're, we've crafted what I call the Scooter Braun principle. And Scooter Braun is the guy that, who found Justin Bieber. And I'm using that as a scenario to say, you know, Justin is a talented kid, no question. He'd probably be, you know, he'd probably be the star of the high school play. I mean, he's a one in a thousand talent, right? But he was create, you know, they what Scooter Braun did was put him together with the music people, the PR people, the handling people, the marketing people, and the event promoters, and everything that you need to create the kind of buzz around that talent that creates, uh, you know, a celebrity intentionally. And you can, you can absolutely create intent- celebrity intentionally. Yeah, absolutely. I, I, I love that. And uh, I think it's a brilliant idea. Uh, what are some of the strategies that you're deploying to help people reach that? Well, we're using a, a com- you know, it's a lot of what we just talked about, right? It's a combination of, on, on the one side, we have to build authority. We have to build that person upon that person's expect, you know, their uh, uh, expert status and put them in a position 
to where in their niche, in their industry, that they are the standard setter. And so one of the, one of the real simple tactics we use there that any of your listeners can learn is that we, we've, what we understand is that only authorities prognosticate. Lots of people report on what's happening, but only authorities really predict and prognosticate about the future. So you, as somebody in the media, you don't really want anybody to come on and just tell you what happened. You, if you're going to have a guest come on, you want them to tell you what's going on in the future. You're looking for somebody to make a bold prediction. So we teach our business clients to create that authority positioning by creating a, a bold prediction about the future of their industry. And then we use the capacity that you have today to publish and to get positioning in media to, to allow that to message to be conveyed throughout, the, throughout that industry. And then when you do a good job of getting that media position and promotion, you begin to leverage it, replicate it, get it into other places, make sure people know about it. And you have to be brave enough to be self-promoting. And that's, uh, that's something that's really difficult for some people. So we have to have the right persona. They're also willing and able to take that bold prediction and put themselves out there and, and be a big personality so that they can fill that space and get that kind of attention. Very interesting. SeanMMiller.com. It's S-H-A-W-N-M Miller.com, in case you have any confusion on how that should look. And sure. um, how many clients do you typically work with at any one time? Well, the process right now, we're looking for 10. So we're building up to 10 for what we've called the billion-dollar roundtable. And those 10, those are those self-made CEOs that we're vetting. And they're going to go through a one-year process together as a group. We're going to do it together. And we're using the, the legendary mastermind principles, of course, of Napoleon Hill uh, to bring those smart people together on top of the authority and celebrity systems that we have here at Performance Institute. And we're going to take those people through a, 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 a 10 person as a, as a mastermind group. And what's really fun with this, that we're really excited about this, but I had the opportunity to have a documentary made about that process. And I think, well, that's really cool on one hand. And it certainly is going to add to the allure, isn't it, for those folks that we want uh, in the group. But now uh, the, we've had the idea with the documentary creator, we're going to turn those into 42-minute segments. And we have a couple of TV producers that are interested in a show to see this journey, and it's sort of something like the uh, like The Apprentice, perhaps, but more focused on these personalities and the journey that they're going to go through in this time to become celebrities. Mm-hmm. So we're excited about that. That's pretty cool. It is SeanMMiller dot com. Sean Miller's been our guest. Thanks so much for being with us. Interesting story. All right, Kevin. Thanks a lot, man. You bet. SeanMMiller.com. I'm Kevin Price. You're listening to The Price of Business. When we come back, much more for you. I want to remind you, best content here can be found over there at usdailyreview.com.